All right, after we have the ice and water installed and have the proper amount of fasteners in it, we're gonna move on to the synthetic felt. Um, same process, we're gonna line it up with the ice and water. There's a nice line right here, you can go by it and that's a sufficient lap amount. You got about four or five inches. So same thing again, unroll it a little bit, get it where you want it. And what I'm gonna do is just take one fastener and go right here, let it sit there for a second. And we can go ahead and roll this on out. That fastener really helps. Sometimes you can do two or three. Um, the only thing you wanna watch out for is you don't wanna nail too far over because what'll happen is if you're not lined up with the roll and you try to roll it to go up or down, it'll wrinkle and it'll look bad and then you'll have a go back. So we're just gonna keep on rolling this out. Like I said, I just put one fastener in the end. We're gonna bring it all the way over. Line it up with the bottom of your ice and water shield. Pull the wrinkles out till you have a smooth surface and go ahead and drive in your fastener. And the same process again, we're gonna nail this more often than usual because this is a steep roof and we're gonna pull that wrinkle out and tighten up the top.